All right, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Super here, and welcome back to another MK11 video. And today we're gonna be uh, playing a little bit with Sub Zero, sort of uh, not really comparing because I'm not gonna be showing footage with this game and MK11. Uh, this is more like talking in general about the feeling of playing Sub Zero, MK11, and MK1. It's definitely a there's some similarities, don't get me wrong, because you still have the 50-50s with Sub-Zero with the overhead and the low. Um, but I just overall feel like Sub-Zero and MK1 is so much more satisfying because he has so many more ways to hit you with different variations of combos. In this game, Sub-Zero is pretty much a 50-50 machine. Uh, he's always been that since the beginning of the game's life cycle. I remember in the pre-release, uh, everyone was picking Sub-Zero because he was a 50-50 machine. So, he's always been that. Oh, and I got the uh, the legit Sub-Zero right here. I got the 50-50s on deck. There's no messing around here. I got, I got the straight up 50-50s. Oh, I dropped the combo. That's how you, um... That's why you would follow it up with the anti, right? Oh shit, you're getting hit by that. Oh, that sucks for her. She was being so cautious too. Round two, fight. What's his combo string again? Okay, that is how you do that. Ooh, just missed her with it. Okay, she has a really good jump in. Actually, it was not meter burn. Huh, where's my meter burn? Ooh. Danger time. Nice. Good block. Oh, I missed the punish, though. Oh, God. I'm pressing buttons. She keeps messing up, which makes me mess up. Because she should have gotten the punish a long time ago. But then she didn't. So then I went to press a button. But I pressed it too late. So then she got the punish again. Oh, my God. You know what I wanted right there. Oh, you know what I wanted when he did stand three. I thought she might uh, be in range there. Okay, that's not, that's not it. Ah, I want her to do the crushing blow. Jump at me. Finish. <laughs> I don't know why that combo dropped. I actually wanted to do the brutality. I was gonna do the meter burn uh, slide brutality right there. I don't know why the uh, the combo dropped. All right, so far so good, Sub Zero. I mean, it, Sub Zero, his whole game plan is gonna be based on. The 50-50, right? Are you going to be able to block his overhead and lows? As a Sub-Zero player, you do have uh, you do have the option to play more of a safe Sub-Zero. 
because I do have my overhead into Devora. low that's pretty much safe. Shinox I mean, there's some players that are going to be able to punish it because I think you can flawless block and do some other stuff, but 99% of people you'll fight online are not going to be able to do any of that shit. So, because I don't even know how to do it. So, the Sub-Zero player could play a more safe Sub-Zero for sure, but I'm going full force, 50-50 unsafe Afraid stuff with Sub-Zero. I'm playing the, uh, the authentic Sub-Zero right here. But just comparing him to MK1, you know, he has so many crazy combos in MK1, it's, it's really fun. Oh, I forgot she has that, that's really cool. I gotta load these up, I always forget to do it. Oh, okay. I thought I was going to be on the... On the... Ah. Block it. Dangerous time. Ooh. I don't remember what the requirement is for that. I definitely didn't want to do it. I was hoping that I would avoid... I think they're all highs, though. I should just duck them. Oh, she has that thing. That's why. Round two. The bugs are all over me. Oh, nice block. Oh, she fucked up. I got it locked and loaded. I think the third one is the one that... She's not doing any um, stinger from her down one or down threes. I'm surprised. That's one of Devorah's best strategies. Because the opponent has to respect it. I'll take that overhead. Oh god. No anti air for me. I was just waiting for my opportunity. She had the magic pixel, so her options were limited. I had all the control. Oh, just a little bit too far. Nice block. Take that damage. That early lead. <gasps> I thought she would be a lot further away. That's punishable, right? That's not punishable? I know that's plus on block. That was my bad. Too late on that. Is that it? Oh, okay, that did it. Oh my god, that was so close. I can't believe I didn't punish that fatal blow. I should have choose these back one right there. All right, Sub Zero, we're mixing people to death. All right, so match numero dos. That's more Sub Zero action. Actually, um, I, I was gonna go with the classic, but I wanted to resemble Sub Zero as close to MK1 as possible. Uh, and this is probably the closest one. I could imagine they went with something that's a little bit more traditional like this Because they show Sub-Zero's hair as well, so I kind of wanted to resemble that a little bit Get that full-on comparison, but yeah, Sub-Zero has a dive kick in MK1. He has one in Injustice. Well, it's kind of a dive kick, but not really It's like a clone dive kick. It's still cool though.
Oops, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Ooh, that range. Shit. Ah, no hit confirm. Okay. Oh, get down too. Whoa. Oh, right when I was pressing my button. I can still make this comeback. Watch this. Oh, shit. I fucked that one up, that's for sure. The delay on the wake up. Oh, I told you I could have made that comeback. All I needed was one more hit. <laughs> one more hit. Kind of want him here in the corner. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. I'm pressing buttons. I jump three. Ah, shit. The old man reactions, ladies and gentlemen. Ah! This is not gonna do it, but it's gonna give me a fighting chance here. Oh my god, that actually did it. Sub-Zero been committing legal robberies since 1992. Wow, that was pretty crazy right there. I deserve to lose a match just for that. <laughs> ah, I was supposed to jump forward right there. Frosty the snowman, but a bad let's sweep him. Okay, I was trying to sweep him just so we could end it right there. Wow, I can't believe I won that match. <laughs> that was highway robbery right there. I honestly didn't think that was gonna do it. I did not think that that was going to finish the match. That was pretty nuts because I saw the little bar like the midway point is 50. And I'm like, okay, that's like very close to 50. It looks like it's about 46%, 47% of his life that he still has left. But no, it was 44%. Aw, oh, damn, he's using the Dimitri Vegas sub zero. <laughs> he really wants to win this one, ladies and gentlemen. He's pulling out the big guns with the Dimitri Vega action. All right, he's like, hell, I'm, I'm, I'm tired of getting mixed up right now. I'm going to mix your shit up. It's fair, it's fair. Round one. Who's down Fight. for is faster? Ooh! Oh, the sweep is faster. Oh, polar ice cap. Sub zero mirror matches? Nope. Oh, I was gonna do the same thing. I wanted to slide. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> what in the reach? Sub-Zero. You are no warrior. 
Dude, <laughs> I, I deserve that. <laughs> I deserve that for sure. Wow, why can't you punish that? I totally deserve to lose that one for sure. <laughs> He's not blocking. <laughs> I totally deserve that loss. I'm gonna jump. Final round fight. Oh, I thought he was gonna do. For the Lin Kuei! Dude, these are the slappiest, sloppiest Sub-Zero <laughs> matches you guys are ever going to see. <laughs> oh my god. I could have finished that easily, but I don't even know what the hell I did. You know what? Let's just call this video. I can't wait to play Sub-Zero and MK1. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. What's going on? It's Super here, and thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did and you aren't subscribed already, make sure you guys do so. And if you want to see some more, there's videos popping up on the screen right now. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.